Tu es où Welcome. Today we were sent a product from our friends at Pride Band. It's another shooting rest, gun rest, rifle rest. Um, got it sitting next to my Caldwell Stinger. They asked me to do a comparison. They asked me to do some testing on it. They asked me to give them back some feedback on my thoughts on where they can improve on this product. So that's what we're going to do today. We're going to look at it, go over it, compare it to the Caldwell Stinger. Try, true, tested, over time, time tested my way, anyway, and it's held up that test of time. So I think it's a great platform to uh, go ahead and compare it to uh, Pride Bin's uh, uh, piece of work here. Their shooting rest. So stay tuned. Hey, don't go nowhere. Your boy Brian's going to be right back. We're going to go over these two gun rests. See where we can come up with some improvements on Pride Bin. Don't go nowhere. All right. So I have uh, Benjamin Kratos sitting on Pride Finn's new uh, gun rest. It has uh, no name. But we'll go over that here more in just a moment. Take these two, set them right down here. So, what do we got here? We got the hot sun flashwood. This is my 25 caliber. Um, but we're talking about the, what it's sitting on. We're all familiar with this. This is Caldwell Stinger. The Caldwell Stinger is pretty much mainly fully in all metal construction. Highly durable. Very strong construction. It's got the rubber leg. But at the end and at the um, elevation, it's got the elevation up and down adjustment at the butt stock where the butt stock rests. Forward stock rest is an all rubber construction, highly durable rubber construction. Caldwell Stinger, like I said, elevates up and down from the back butt stock, and it also elevates the front stock, front of the rifle. You want to clamp these, you can move this front stock um, holder up and forth, back and forth. And it clamps down very tight. Tried and true tested uh, platform. In comes Benjamin Kratos on Pride Fence Gun Rest. This is a solid plastic construction molded. It's three different parts. Well, actually, roughly four different parts. As you can see,
one unit. These untwist, unlock. It is adjustable for length. Pull. The front is adjustable for elevation. That's the only that's one thing. It's very, very then they're very tight. Hard to get back down. Very hard to make, get back down at the end. They had made it to where it twists down. The way it twists up, you twist this. See, it's got this uh, screw uh, at the bottom. But uh, when you twist the other way, all you can do is press it back down. So that's one thing I would change. Okay, second thing I would change, like the Caldwell Stinger, the back of the buttstock had an elevation, had an adjustment for the elevation of the back of the buttstock. This does not fix. Therefore, your gun is never going to be level sitting on this rest. The rest does, uh, it's molded, it's got these cups to where you can hold pellets. Will Allen wrenches tools. Um, it's got a cutout cupped area here and in the front here. It's got at the back where your butt stock rests. It's padded and rubbered. You got two points there. Up front you've got two points padded and rubbered. At the bottom you got five points. One, two, three, four, and five. For anti-slip. Keep it from slipping. That's pretty good. Not too bad. Put the gun back on it. Just unlock. <coughs> me. And then you lock it back into place. Get it to where you want to adjust your rifle to. Because I got bipod on there. And you just twist these and lock them down. Like I said, it's a sturdy construction, it's all plastic, um, but it's hard, molded plastic. There's no elevation in the back butt, butt rest, but that could be compensated with your hand. Over and all, I give it a uh, B plus. Um, it'd be nice. Brad Finn, if there was an easier elevate um, adjustments for the front and something for the back at butt stop. Other than that, you look like you got a great product. Hey, thank you for watching this, guys. Um, just a real quick comparison video and some info for Pride Ben.
just to get this out to you guys. Uh, they got this uh, online at Amazon. So uh, you can pick it up there. So uh, y'all take care of yourselves. Remember to like, comment, subscribe. God bless you. Hey, y'all do the rest.